Hey there everyone, this is Danielle playing some more Pokemon Swoosh. Last time we cleared the water type gym and got this outfit, which I'm now wearing. To put it on I had to go back to Motorstoke and find a changing room there because apparently there are no changing rooms in the Pokemon centers in this game. But there were in X and Y, so that's confusing. Anyway, uh, we are required to go to the seafood restaurant and meet with Chairman Rose. Uh, this is the restaurant here. I don't really want to go to a seafood restaurant, not really my thing, but we have to go there according to the game, so there you go. Pickish! The lamp over here. It's a chair I can't sit on. It just feels like they didn't put that much polish into this game. I don't know. Hmm. I guess it was rushed. Welcome to the seafood restaurant, the captain's table. Oh, oh, Sonia's over there. I love Sonia. She's baby. Hello. Chairman Rose comes in incognito, but the word always gets out when he's here. Danielle, let's celebrate your recent victory. Oh, were you invited too? You two know each other? That's great. Come now, please be seated. God, saying is pretty. Holbury is a seafood town. Naturally, if one is going to eat here, the obvious choice is the local cuisine. If you say so, I'm not really interested, but everything on the menu is delicious. By the way, how is Professor Magnolia getting on? I'm quite indebted to her, you know. She was the one who figured out how to unleash the power of wishing stars and use that power with Dynamax Pokemon. We never would have been able to create Dynamax bands without her. <sighs> she was saying that there's still so much we don't know about Dynamaxing. It's causing us some worry. She even made me take a power spot detector with me when I started traveling. A power spot detector? That's the device that allowed me to discover the power spots. Um, what? <laughs> You discovered them using a device that... <sighs> how do you how did you make a power spot detector without knowing about power spots? Locations that emit Galar particles and allow Pokemon to Dynamax. Oh, it's the Galar region because Galar particles are here. Okay. I don't like hearing that Professor Magnolia is so worried though, if only there was something I could do. Sonya, it may be good for you to visit the vault in Hammerlock. I believe the key to unlocking the secrets of the Dynamax phenomenon lies in the history preserved there. Understood, Chairman. I will arrange a meeting with Miss Sonia. However, I believe it is about time we get going, Chairman. Hmm? But I've hardly had a chance to speak with Danielle. It's regrettable, but I suppose it can't be helped. If something needs to get done, there's no time like the present, after all. In any case, I bid you all farewell. <sighs> Does he think he's doing me a favour? He's right that the vault would be a good place to look for info on the legends, but... You got the water badge, yeah? Defeating Nessa's no small feat. Here's a TM as a reward. You obtained TM79, Retaliate. Well, I mean, I got a TM as a reward already, but thank you. Revenge for a fainted ally. If an ally fainted in the previous turn, this move's power is increased. Nessa's a good friend. Perhaps I should drop in on her. Until next time, Jim Challenger. Oh, she's gonna go kiss her girlfriend. Oh, <laughs> adorable. I'm so proud of them both. Okay, I guess I'm done here. Oh, all right, mate. You've got both the grass badge and the water badge by now, right? In that case, we're both headed for Motorstoke and the fire gym leader, Kabu. How about I share with you a little tip about that leader, Kabu? From what I heard, he's holed up now in Galar Mine Number Two, undergoing some special training. He's in there and we can't take him on in motor circuit if we zip right over there, putting the brakes on our gym challenge. So I say we head to Galar Mine number two ourselves. Let's go see what all the fuss is about. Okay, you don't want to fight me? Okay, all right. Well, we gotta go this way, so. I believe there were some Team Yell folks blocking this path. They are now gone, so we can go. Off onwards. <laughs> Oh my goodness. Uh, okay, so this is the mine, just immediately. Uh, what have we got here? Do I have one of these already? Throw a gunk. Are you like poison type or? I don't know. Uh, let's try water gun. 
I want to catch it if I can, but I might be too strong. Ooh, no, that worked well. Okay. Venoshock. I don't know if that was a poison move or what. Used a Pokeball. Mashing the button right now. Yeah, mashing works. <laughs> Pro Gunk was caught. Pretty sure mashing doesn't do anything, but it's it's funny. Crawling Skater will be added to the Pokédex. Once diluted, its poison becomes medicinal. This Pokémon came into popularity after a pharmaceutical company chose it as a mascot. Ugh. Gross. Alright. Um. Uh, Crawl Gunk Mars. Uh. Carly. Like iCarly. There we go. Uh, go to a box. Oh, what else we got here? The little bats flying away from me. Uh, I don't think... Do I have one of these guys already? Hello. It's Choodle with Big Mouth. <laughs> uh, no, I don't have a Choodle either. Uh, let's use... Uh, Sucker Punch? Oh, it used Protect, so Sucker Punch is gonna fail. Yeah. Uh, let's try Water Gun. I don't want to defeat it, I want to catch it, so... Is it just gonna keep using Protect? No, it failed that time. Okay, cool. Okay, good. Water Gun doesn't do too much damage, you should be able to whittle it down a bit more. Mm. Headbutt. Uh, then let's use Bind, which is a lot weaker, and that should whittle it down into the red, hopefully. Squidge, squidge. Yep. Don't faint, don't faint, don't faint. Ah, oh, dang it. Bind is stronger than I anticipated. <laughs> oh my goodness. <laughs> <laughs> okay, um, come here, bat. You're running away from me, which means I probably want to catch you. Noi bat. What are you like? Dark Sonic type? You seem to be like wind themed. I don't know what type that is. Uh, let's see if we can. What, how much damage we do. Okay, not very effective, but it did a lot of damage. I'll try bind next turn. Hopefully that's not too much. Okay, you're, you're probably flying type because you have wing attack. Maybe. You might not be. Uh, you avoided the attack. I also avoided the attack. What a coincidence. Okay, there we go. Squeeze! Used bite. Okay, so maybe you are dark type. Okay, you're in the red. Let's let's do this. Ba -dum -bum, bum, bum, ba -da, click. Yeah. No, that was caught. I might need to heal up now. Cynthia's kind of taking a beating here. She's not really strong enough for this area. Sada will be added to the Pokédex. No wavelength of sound is beyond Noibat's ability to produce. The ultrasonic waves it generates can overcome much larger Pokémon. Flying and Dragon. Okay. Interesting. Uh, let's say your name will be Nathan. Nathan the Noibat. Uh, get a box. Uh, where's that thing? B binacle? Gross. I don't like it. <laughs> I feel like it might be water type, so using a water type move may... No, it knocked it out. Also, it's not water type, apparently. Or maybe it is. I forget if water's weak or strong against itself. I think it's just, like, normal against itself. Uh... 
What about this one? Hello. Shellos. Level 23. Uh, let's try a water gun. Okay, not very effective. So you're something... Hang on, using ancient power. That wasn't super effective. Hmm. I don't know what type you are. Let's use a water pulse. Uh, recover? Alright, that's a move you have. I want to catch you. I wonder how many recovers they have. I don't know how many you normally get. Uh, let's try... Okay, water's not strong against you, so I probably need to switch Pokemon and use something else. Um, but I don't know what type you are. Let's try electric. Puppy. Ancient Power has the same type as its user, but I don't know what type that is. No, it's not the same type as the user, it's it's more complicated than that. Ancient Power is a weird move. Uh, try Bite. Flinched in, couldn't move, okay. Uh, let's try Nuzzle to lower you a bit more. Hopefully it doesn't, like, critical super effective or something. Oh, that's good. It is super effective. Oh, Paralysis, that's what I want. Gosh, you're shallowest. Let's find out what the heck you are. <laughs> dun, 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 dun. Shallowest's data will be added to the Pokedex you're just water type? Alright. Its appearance changes depending on the environment. One theory suggests that living in cold seas causes shells to take on this form. So this is the East Sea form? I guess it has others. Hmm. Uh, let's say... Uh... Saul. There we go. Uh, and then I think I'm probably gonna hit the Pokemon Center. Because... Yeah, I kind of got whittled down there a little bit. Use your bicycle. Hello, nurse. Here is my Pokemons. Do 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 do. Thank you. Uh, that's the same- yeah, that's another one of these. Hello, Shellos again. Um, I guess I could fight it, but... Mm. Yeah, water's not very effective. I'll try Psycho Punch, it might work. It failed, yeah, because he's using Recover. With full health. I'll, I'll try it again. Are you going to use an attack this move? Yes. Ancient Power. So... Yeah, Ancient Power doesn't have the same type as your Pokémon's type, it's like, it's based on something. It's very confusing. It's based on like your Pokémon's like IVs or whatever, which which type their Ancient Power has. Um, and it's very unpredictable. It's a weird move. Recover, aren't you? Yeah. Jerk. I probably need more general attacking moves on, on um Cynthia to handle this sort of thing. Uh let's just use water pulse. You know it's not very effective, but I get I get same type attack bonus and it's pretty strong to begin with. 
Wow, that was really bad. Oh no, they have Water Pulse too. Oh no! Oh, it confused me. I'm not going well here. Uh... Try a Sucker Punch? But it failed, because they're going to use Recover. These guys are hard to fight. Okay. Uh... I am going to avoid fighting these, because wow. <laughs> uh, I'm going to need electric moves, yeah. So let's bring Charles back out. Because yeah, electric is good against water. Just why I should be using it. You're in charge, Charles. Charles in charge. Five days and no night. I forget what I'm referencing, but there's like a song or something. Spark? Oh, that's more like it. That's what I want. That's what I want. And Water Pulse won't be super effective because I'm a puppy. It does okay damage, but it's not super effective or anything. Tackle should be enough to deal with that. Clunk. Yep, there we go. Goodbye, Shellos. Level 24. Okay, uh, let's... Oh, I got off my bike. Oh, okay. I probably should have uh, healed before fighting Bead. We'll see how we go. You again. I feel sorry for my Pokemon if I made them take part in a battle against low-level opponents. I'm not in the mood to deal with weaklings right now. Then again, I suppose it's a form of mercy to crush weak opponents early on. If you're under the misguided impression that you're stronger than me, then surely would you, be up, you would be up for a Pokemon battle. Uh, alright. It's utterly inconceivable that I, the challenger chosen by the chairman, will lose. You were challenged for a Pokemon trainer bead. I should be okay, honestly. I can probably manage. Solosis, what's that? I... I still don't know what that is. What am I looking at? Uh, let's try Water Pulse, since it's effective. Okay, yeah, I should be fine. Hmm, looks like you've grown a bit. Only a little bit, though. Psy Shock. I guess it's something psychic type. Ooh. Let's do it again. Yeah. Goodbye, Solosis. Uh, I might need to switch Pokemon after this. Gatheta. That's bug type, I think? Let's keep current Pokemon and see how we go. Oh, I don't know what type that is. Uh, Psycho Punch is super effective, but very unlikely to work. Let's try it. Let's take the risk. Yep, it worked. Okay, you use Psy Shock as well. If you say so. Ooh. Water Pulse, come on, be faster, be faster. Yes, okay. Goodbye, Gathita. Okay, then I'm gonna switch to something else for this last part. Bada bada bum. Bada bada bum. Hatena, uh, yeah, switch. I don't know what Hatena is, so let's use something... Let's just try Carl, I guess? I got Flame Charge. I... I don't know what anything's type is in this game. <laughs> uh, oh my goodness. Okay, that's adorable. Um, okay, Flame Charge is effective, apparently, so let's use it. Let's see how we go. Hmm, it's not great, but that makes my speed go up, so... It's not every day I get to battle you, so I suppose I may as well try out this move. Psybeam. Ooh, yeah, I can manage. I don't know what type my Ancient Power is, but let's try it and see. Use Ancient Power. Rock, 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 rock. Uh, it was good. It wasn't super effective, but it was good. Uh, playing charge again. Slam, and a win. 
Goodbye, Hatena. I still don't know what type you are. Oh, Ponyta, you have another Pokemon. Uh, hmm, well, against a Ponyta, I really want Cynthia, but I don't know if she's strong enough to make it. Uh, let's send her out and see how we go. Because, you know, fire. Oh, wait, hang on. It might be it might be Galarian Ponyta and be Psychic type. I didn't think of that. Excellent. Not everyone can corner my team like this. It is Galarian Ponyta. It's Psychic type. Okay, I need something else. Oh my god. Um, what's good against Psychic? Is Dark? I think Dark is good against Psychic, so I probably want Charles and use Bite. Confusion. Yeah, that's one of the weaker moves they have, so let's buy it. Okay, please, please work well. I think, I think... Yeah, I was right. Yeah, super effective. Oh, thank goodness. I'm not very good at the type advantages. Bada bump. You showed at least a little effort, so I decided I should let you win. You got 2760 for winning. Send some to mum. No, it doesn't happen in this game. Oh! Oh, Natalie's evolving! I'm so proud of her! Oh! Oh, she's a big squirrel! Big chumby squirrel! Greedent! Oh, that's adorable. What's the Pokedex say? Common throughout the Galar region, this Pokemon has strong teeth and can chew through the toughest of berry shells. Do berries come in shells? They can move Covet. Uh, I think so? I think Covet is good, right? Let's have a look. The user endearly, endearingly approaches the target, then steals the target's held item. It also does 60, 60 power damage, so that's pretty good. Um, I might drop Stockpile and Spit Up for Covet, because Covet sounds better. Uh, it's also the same type. Ah, uh, pardon me. Seems I must take back my words. You're not weak. You just lack talent. Your chances of completing the gym challenge are pretty slim, I must say. Here, I'll give you this. Something to show you at least tried. You got Bede's League card. You put the League card in your album. Now where shall I go next to collect wishing stars? Alright then, I'm gonna go heal. I did defeat Nessa and I am quite the trainer, thank you. Do 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 Thank you. Okay, let's continue. Uh, I haven't got one of these yet, so let's give it another try. Binacle? What type are you, Binacle? Um... Normal's bad against you, so you're probably fighting type? Probably? Uh, let's try Water Pulse and see how it goes. You might have really, like, really high defense or something. Nope. Okay. Fury Swipes. Okay. Let's try a not very effective move just to wield you down a bit more. Squeeze, squeeze. Fury Cutter. Avoided the attack. Well done, Cynthia. Ooh, yep, that looks good. Let's go. Let's go. You used a Pokeball. Ah, dang it. So you get hurt by Bind and get killed because it's already at really low health. <sighs> Curses. 
I probably need to stock up on great balls. Uh, hello, Stunfist. I didn't, didn't see you. I don't know what type you are either. Uh, let's, let's try Water Pulse. Oh, you used Sucker Punch on me. Okay, I see. So I guess you're Dark type? Or you have a Dark type move anyway. Um, let's try Sucker Punch on you. Okay. Okay, now you're in red health. Let's try to catch you, see if we can. Use the Pokeball. Nope, nope, that was not enough. Metal sound. What did the attack? Uh, bind? Ooh. Uh, let's just throw a Great Ball. And yeah, I need to stock up on these because I am running low on both types. Oh, really? Rude. Did Metal Sound do damage or just reduce my special defense? Just reduced his defense, I think. Whatever, let's just defeat it. Uh, and then I can go buy some more Great Balls. Goodbye, Stunfisk. 29, yeah. Do I get a pat move? No, no moves at level 29. Alright. I, I guess it was just on the ground and I didn't notice it because it's like ground colored. Like camouflage, I guess. Not a fan of how the bicycle boost works in tandem with going between areas. It doesn't, um, because if you've used it, you still have to wait the same amount of time for it to recharge, but the boost itself doesn't carry between the door, so if you use it in one on one side of the door, it goes away, but you don't get to reuse it. <sighs> do, 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 do. Okay. Uh, the Pokemon is just over here, so, yeah, let's stock up. Uh, I made a buy. Yeah, great ball. Uh, let's get 10 of those. Maybe more. 10 more, there we go. And I'll, I guess, sell my remaining Pokeball. It's probably not worth very much, but I might as well get rid of it. Oh, there's two actually. Yeah, I don't need them. Goodbye, Pokeballs. <laughs> And there's a bunch of held items in here. Treasures? Okay, I just need to sell these and I get money. I don't think there's anything else you can do with the treasures apart from just sell them. Uh, I'm not too worried, I'll hang on to them for now in case I might want them for something else. Not that I expect to want them for something else. Hmm, yeah, the bicycle controls are a little questionable. Oh yeah, I can see there's like a Pokeball that's sort of sitting on the ground there. So, is that the Stunfisk? Yeah, it is. It pops up when you walk in that spot. Oh, I see. It's got a little Pokeball as its mouth. Okay. Okay, I get it now. Alright, um... Let's leave with a Water Pulse. It should whittle it down pretty far, because I leveled up, I'm a little bit stronger. Yeah. Oh, I confused it. Okay. Put itself in its confusion, yeah. Uh, doesn't choose bind, which is not very effective. Just to whittle it down a bit more. Squeeze, squeeze. Uh, my shot's pretty damaging, and my drops my speed, which is not good. Okay, let's try a good great ball. See how we go. That's more like it. There we go. Stun Fisk was caught. <laughs> oh my goodness. 
Stunned with excited, or will be added to the Pokedex. It's conspicuous slips for prey in as it lies in wait in the mud. When prey gets close, Stunned Fist climbs its jagged seal, fins down on them. So it, it's a it's a bear trap as a Pokemon. Weird. That is some weird evolution. Ground Steel. Interesting combo. Uh, yeah, I'll give you a name. Um, Stuart. I think is a good name for a Stunned Fisk. There we are. My Pokemon is bursting with energy. What I mean to say is, please battle me. Worker Francis? Sent out Carcol. Oh, you're in trouble. See, uh, I have a, have this uh, water type here. It's very strong. Uh, sorry. <laughs> Yeah! <laughs> oh my goodness. Oh, Incinerate, that sounds good. Let's have a look. Uh, it's more powerful. If Pokemon is holding a certain item, such as a berry, the item becomes burned up and unusable. Um, rapid Spin Power 50. Flame Charge 50. Rapid Spin 50. I might change Tackle to Incinerate, because I'm not likely to need that much. Forget Tackle and Incinerate. Bada -bada. Thanks, Worker Francis. A loss is a loss. My Pokémon lost its energy too. Uh, 2100 money. What's this? Three Dusk Balls. A somewhat different Pokeball that makes it easier to catch wild Pokemon at night or in dark places, such as caves. Alright, um, it's been a half hour, I'm going to stop this video here, and we'll continue into the mine further in the next video. So, thank you for watching, and I hope you enjoyed. Ding, ding, ding.